hello gemini welcome back to the channel all right so gemini we're gonna go ahead and start your mega so if this message does resonate with you remember to like the video give this video a big thumbs up here on the channel if it does not resonate you guys i will have your playlist in the description box check that out hopefully one of the messages resonate if this one does not this is going to be a general so not every one of my videos resonate for you so or it won't resonate for you if it's so far if it has well my god <laughs> you know but if it doesn't don't worry about it it was just not your day-to-day -day. um you know i do daily readings so your girl is always on here okay all right so let's get into it gemini we're going to do some different swatches so I'm going to also do your first swatch. I'm going to go into your person's energy swatch, your energy plus your future together. I want to include you and your person um, conclusion, like how you feel towards each other. And I want to include some messages as well. So let's see um, if I can get this video under an hour, but let's see where the angels take us. Okay. All right, Gemini, please. Thank you, angels. What's going on for Gemini? What messages do we have for Gemini and their person? Thank you. All right. So we have trust the process. We have, yes, it was someone else. It's just not over yet. We need to talk about this. Then we have, they told me you cheated, but you still think that's okay. Wow. Mm, okay. Please stop crying. Someone playing the victim card here. I blocked you because you deserved it. I want nothing from you. So I'm getting a lot of fire sign here, Aries, Leo, or Sag. I'm getting some water sign too, Scorpio, Cancer, Pisces. I'm getting a lot of earth signs as well. Capricorn, um, Virgo, Taurus, okay? So I feel like, you know, someone has really just given up on, I'm not gonna, I hate using this term, but life. Um, I feel like for some of you, you've probably been with this person for a very long time. And now that things are going like this, you lost your way. You're, you're, you're just not understanding the process here. And the angels want you to know to keep trust in the process. Because once you give us their, them time to understand what's going on in the physical world, um, you'll be like, wow, thank you, angels. Um, and then I have, yes, it was someone else. Um, you know, for some of you, this is coming up as a third party situation here. It could be somebody involved here to, that made this problem, but I'm guessing like this person is saying yes, it was someone else, obviously, because someone had been going back and forth, like, where you been at? You're not into this relationship. Your mind is like checked out. You're not really looking at me the same way again. Are you losing love? Like somebody is asking questions here. And this person is just like going through a circle with you, like with your mind, playing tricks, like a cycle and they're confirm it well the spiritual world is confirming it that yes it's someone else here all right so let's see if we could get a little bit more messages here but i'm seeing like someone is playing the victim a lot someone is crying about this relationship being over or i'm seeing like you're telling them probably to get their bags and, and leave and this person is like crying, <laughs> crying about this whole situation. <sighs> yeah, look at this. We have, you're just too weak for me. You're just too weak. Someone definitely cheated here. Wasn't strong enough to pass the test. I'm running for the hills. Bye bye. Wow. Okay. No means no. So someone is begging for another chance. Defying timing is a must on this back of this deck. So the angels need to get 
their work done or they're trying to you know work fast enough but they can't work fast on your behalf until you actually let this thing go and let them do their jobs um, whether it is giving this person the karmic energy that they deserve or making this person come back to you if your relationship and your family is important and you want to keep them together um, they don't want you your energy is as hard as it is and it is oh I can't even speak as hard as it is in the physical world um, you know when you're going through emotions because that's what the spiritual and physical um, is that's why it's different because in the spiritual we don't feel um, we understand a lot of things that's going on and we accept things very faster than in the physical world the physical we have this body so we feel a lot of emotions and they linger for a long time in the spiritual we get it we feel it we let it go okay but here is just linger for years and years and years and years and probably all your life but it's up to you to do the work and meditate and pray and remove all negative energy from your thoughts your mind so the angels can say okay I got this you know and that's what they want to do here so let's see what's um, Gemini situation looking like it please with the tarot angels what messages do you have for us for Gemini your person please Gemini and your person Gemini and the person please thank you angels one more shuffle we have the strength we have Leo vibes here so get ready for a conversation this person this is like a typical reading again because it's like they did so much and then I see this energy of strength coming towards you to fix something here then we have the two of cups in separation soulmate connection in separation is killing this person you're thinking about them they're thinking about you but the thing about it is I feel like at this point you're just really disappointed with this person you're not even looking back to be with this person if anything it's all about closure here okay but you have mutual feelings for this person it's not about the love it's morally about the respect here all right all right so we have the page of pentacles this person is like scared when he comes to a legacy but here they are coming off so confident in front of you like nothing is hurting them like you know but when it comes to like a legacy they just don't have it i'm feeling like it's a friend, like a show like it's all a show here i'm seeing like someone is definitely working very hard right now on their money on their taking their time like investing in their time and in, in things that it's about money okay but i'm seeing like an energy that they're not on your level this is what i'm seeing like this person is just not on your level Ugh, what do i mean by that like they're just trying to get towards what you have going on you're very i'm getting like you're very successful with your with what, what you want to do in this life and you're there but this person is not there yet I'm getting like they're trying to impress you. Look at them holding up this and you know, all these wands here. I'm being protective, you know, after they burnt you out and everything. They made you run for the hills. That's like this, you know, this horse, this, 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 this zebra. Is this a zebra? <laughs> Listen, okay. Running for the hills or something like that. I mean, this is what you, this is what they see. This is what I see for you, like. You know, all these wands, like things are falling apart here. They burnt you out, made you feel so tired. Disappointments falling at your feet. But yet they want to make things work. And for some of you, you're torn because you don't know what to do. 
because you love them okay so let's see here the king of swords the queen of pentacles the king of pentacles i'm getting so many connection confirmation here Woof. you guys are the same so this person act like they don't what is this they're throwing me off because this person is the same so you're both very successful but this person is something about they're not making any moves towards something that they're supposed to do with you. Like they gave you empty promises here. They're not making any move towards fixing this. This is what I'm hearing. Okay. They're not mature enough to fix it, but yet they are financially successful. Or they have what they need. Page of Swords. Universe. I'm seeing like this person is young though, very immature energy, but on the outside, they look so mature. That's what threw me off. On the outside, this person looks mature. On the inside, they're very immature. They're manipulative. Page of Swords. And you're blocking them. Because they stress you out. Okay. Okay, so I'm seeing like stress here. I'm seeing like someone was crying. Someone was in like a lot of depression state with this person i'm also seeing like this person wasn't someone that helped you to be make to make you a better person i'm seeing like you had to give this person more than you received from them it wasn't a give a given relationship between two people it was like a give and take here this is what i'm hearing then you have the Empress, ooh, the Five of Cups. So this person is highly thinking about you here. No surprise here. I'm getting a lot of Earth signs, you guys. This person is trying to th throw me off, but we have so much to go through, so they're not going to even succeed. Um, but I'm seeing like this person is thinking about you a lot you know in this five of cups here they really want to approach you but ooh, okay so you're gonna okay okay look at this oh my goodness all right we have the ace of pentacles we have the high priestess here this is your energy okay there is a marriage here this is what this is what they're trying to tell me there is a marriage here there's a contract here you both are tied up with this money none of you want to let this go this is what they're telling me all right this is why the immaturity is here because this person is throwing me the hell off they're saying this person wants to take everything and you feel like take what you didn't do anything to get it but this person is i'm feeling like you guys are going to stick with each other because of this money issue but you want to free yourself you don't know what to do. <laughs> They're looking at you as someone that they cannot give up. This is why. I'm like, what the hell is going on? They're looking at you as someone that they cannot give up. This is why. They're making so many quick moves to do all of these things to you. You're going to get a lot of messages from this person um, about this Ace of Pentacles, this family. You know, a lot of talks, a lot of, of course, they have a lot of passion towards you. And the truth is they do love you as well. There is love there. This is what's causing the whole issue. A lot of love, a lot of pride. You both are acting the same, like you both are cut from the same cloth here. Both are the same. Okay, you probably are giving this person a lot of manipulative ways too. I mean, whew, you guys, the energy. 
but they are looking at you as the best thing they ever had <laughs> the best thing that they, they ever had here all right i'm seeing like this person is asking you for a second chance here so let me see tell me more i feel like what's going on is that they don't want to get a divorce you guys they don't want this relationship to end they don't want you guys to go your separate ways so like they're like it's a lot that we have built the nine of wands so much history so many crap that they put you through okay so let's see here angels gemini a year from now i'm seeing like communication i'm seeing like you know a lot of things are going to be completed here a new direction in life i'm seeing like answers i'm seeing you and this person talking being in an agreement hold on listen to your intuition that came up twice here with a high priestess in reverse and you're not listening to your intuition you're like trying to find out where you need to go here what you need to do because you don't at this point but the angels are seeing this you need to listen to your intuition here all right so let's see we have opportunity so there's going to be a shift here you guys look at this forgiveness no need to worry okay and then they back wait so don't make any drastic decision right now because there's going to be communication for you and this person to get on the same page here the angels are working on this you know they want you to let go they want you to forgive i feel like we just talked about this with these messages here i'm seeing like you and this person work very well together opportunities are going to come abundance are going to come this is why you guys are so successful with each other I don't know who this message is for, but damn, it's like really confusing. Like I'm getting this really confusing vibe here. Look at this abundance, abundance, romance. Look at this. <laughs> Remain positive. Oh my God. Okay. All these beautiful cards. Like this is what you don't see. <laughs> Gemini. So let's do your um, feelings and your person's feelings because maybe that will clear up a lot of things here okay okay i like to do that i like to be on the same page <laughs> okay that was my uk accent but i don't have one <laughs> I, don't have, I don't have one okay so i wish i did i love their accent oh my god so sexy but let's see, um, Scorpio, what's your energy towards this person? First, what's Scorpio? I'm sorry, not Scorpio, Gemini. Don't come for me. What's <laughs> Gemini? <laughs> energy towards this person. Um, Gemini, I, you have to understand, okay? I only do Scorpio and Gemini on this channel, okay? So forgive me if I might say. Scorpio in your reading or then in Scorpio's reading I say Gemini <laughs> but angels please give me Gemini's feelings towards this person <sighs> please give me Gemini's feelings towards this person please thank you angels Gemini's feelings towards this person wow wow okay all right so you feel like this person is a cycle like it never ends <laughs> this person just put you through it all the time you want it to work you look at this person as someone that is very financially stable and they act like they're single at times you feel like you cannot show your real feelings towards this person and you have to keep a lot of secrets or things to yourself because you can't really open up to them. I'm also seeing like this person put you through a lot of doubt in yourself and this is an issue. Let's be nosy here. Yeah, so this person put you through a lot with not really having your back, making you feel like they backstabbed you here. 
and have you to be like i need some time for myself i need to heal i need to find out what gemini wants here i'm seeing blockage this person could be an aries leo or sag energy as well and i'm seeing like this person could be stubborn you're saying but you know they want to come back and redo this whole situation this is what you're telling me like they're not making any movements towards a legacy which we talked about but i feel like you guys built this legacy but this person wants to take it away from you but you're saying like they have nothing to do with it but they want to take what you oh my god what you built or help them build okay so let me let's see what this person got going on what's gemini person's feelings towards gemini <laughs> they're looking at you as the empress Psh, yeah better than them i kind of had that feeling didn't i say that when i was doing the reading? like this person wasn't on your level because i knew i wasn't going crazy it was like too many messages for this person like they're looking at you as the empress you're looking at them as the knight of pentacles or the the emperor is also here but you're also looking at them as you know like someone that can defend you you know you're the you're the empress and the emperor but at the uh, at the current this is how they appear to be as the empress i mean not the empress the emperor but they're actually underneath the knight of pentacles which they're like hiding their true selves this is what you're trying to tell me about this person. This person will hit you as an empress. <laughs> They're saying you're ready to move on. But they know that you love them. They're saying there's a lot of love here, but you're you like it's an end to this relationship because of these choices that they had. <laughs> oh my god. This person is so immature, you know? I'm getting like this person's not ready for a committed relationship. They never were, but they kind of fell into it. You know, they realize that this relationship is over. They're not making any moves. They're waiting for you to make all the moves. They're right. They're actually watching you. That's about it. Waiting for you to do everything. You're the, it's like they don't think they deserve, they deserve you. Uh, it's like a really crazy. I felt this energy too with Scorpio's read it that i just did it's like that that same feeling that they think you are better than them like they need to be with someone who is on their level that makes them feel complete that makes them feel like they're not being judged to be with someone that just like them you know like that how they're feeling like emotionally that's what they need um, they feel like how they're feeling emotionally is not you. You are up there. You have plans for yourself. Um, they feel like they're always being judged by you. I don't want to say it like that, but they see, they think that you end this relationship and you're just ready to move on with someone else very quickly. And you're ready to end things with them very quickly. It's like boom, boom, boom. Like, <laughs> you know, they feel like this is what you wanted wow it's interesting hi oh, neil if you guys made it here um to 23 minutes go ahead and like this video okay give this video a big thumbs up here um so that youtube can push the videos forward into a bigger audience so the video can grow so the channel can grow okay all right, so let's go ahead and do your person's energy. I want to hear their story. Then we're going to do your energy, um, Gemini, and then we're going to do the future, okay? All right, so what's this person's energy, please? Tell me about Gemini person's energy, what they want Gemini to know moving forward. All right, on their end. All right, so I'm seeing the eight of pentacles in reverse so on their end they think that this relationship is definitely not gonna happen for them they pretty much feel like you moved on so 
all right so let's see are you checked out of this relationship look at that the four of swords they think that you're like checked out but the truth is you just need time you need time to recharge reset you need time for yourself this person needs to respect that okay they know that they made you feel anxiety pain like you couldn't breathe here they were holding back on a lot of their emotions not because they don't want to they just don't feel like it's gonna work you know they feel like they can't make you happy so they're not making any moves to try to fix this but there will be communication but it's not something that you're gonna understand because they feel like you're gonna um that you're gonna be very guarded and that's your right <laughs> this person is like a child you guys their energy that i'm you know challenging right now it's like they're a child okay all right so we have the two of cups hmm <laughs> no look at that they want to be back together i know you do i know you do but it's just that you don't have any confidence. But when this person, you know, <laughs> come in front of you, though, you would never know that they have confident issues because like in like like in the strength card, I feel like this person appears to be this big person, like like how we got the king of pentacles and the queen of pentacles in reverse. I just feel like this person like they just appear to be this person to you but the truth is inside they're so small you know i'm getting like they want to talk to you like they want this reunion but they feel like you ended this relationship here so this page of swords like you block them you block them because you see what they truly are yeah a child yeah they made the wrong decision here you're not having it and then here is the star it's funny this star keeps showing up <sighs> it's all about the star someone is praying to the universe hoping that the universe will help them through this situation and bring you right back to them this person feels like you belong in their lives for some reason and you know you guys are soulmates with a contract here they cannot they're trying to like walk away they're trying to leave this situation but they cannot because it's a contract mm, between you and this person all right so we have the seven of wands yeah this person's energy this is definitely like a fire sign you guys i'm getting all right so we have your energy where you're just like, you don't know what you want to do. You're like, caution, caution, caution. Whatever you do, you're just going to think about all the bad things that this person have done to you. So I'm seeing like this person lied to you, betrayed your trust here, and they try to protect you from something or the truth, right? But this situation fell out of their own control here. The lies start to like pile up and then you start to find out everything, okay? I'm definitely seeing like this person, they're not, they wasn't there to try to fix this right away. They just stand back and they let the fear of your words control them. They're just scared of what you might say. I'm seeing like here we have the tower you know this person wants to you know undo this breakup I'm telling you I'm telling you this person wants you back and then you have the queen of swords the king of swords soulmate connection confirmation again two people do is exactly alike but do things differently to get the same results in the very end um and that's the problem like they do like this person is doing different things but you handle things in a different way so in that journey when you're making those decisions and you're trying to fix something to get that result you you stay with the course but this person comes off of the course and get themselves in trouble okay all right so here we have the selfish energy someone that is only thinking of themselves 
someone that has been checked out of this connection and thinking that they always been around but they have not in this four of pentacles so let's see here hmm. yeah someone had a lover and you know about this um your person wants to make this work but i'm seeing you tying up loose ends like this is you like you're just like done 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 it's a wrap it's sealed it's delivered you know sign the papers i mean a lot of you have kids together you know they're saying marriage here for two of cups to be here it came up a, a lot in this reading so far where you know guys they're looking at you as one they're not making any moves not making any moves to fix this they're so stuck in the situation they just don't even know what to do at this point um they have a lovers that they're still sleeping with that brought a lot of distress a lot of things into your life you know about this you're releasing your energy from this stress this is what i see you're moving forward they know that they're saying everything they're seeing everything this is how they uh, see you um gemini as you're moving forward you just don't care about it you found out about this i could act like this person but i did that in my other video and i was watching it i'm like damn i'm so annoying i don't want to be annoying today <laughs> But this person has another person and they're like, yeah, you know, Gemini found out that I was dating someone else or sleeping with someone else. Very passionate connection that I'm not going to give up, by the way. And, you know, Gemini decided to just, you know, act like they were cold. Like, I don't know what Gemini is emotionally. This is what they're saying. Like, you just act like you just don't care. Like, at first it was bothering you. And then one day you woke up and you just started to dress in your Gucci and stuff like that again you know what i'm saying <laughs> you took out the gears out of the closet gemini okay but you're looking at this person as you know you ain't gonna be in a third situation a, 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 a relationship that has three people in it okay you're looking at this as a dud all right so let's do your energy on what's going on here all right let's use another deck to get that energy rolling all right can you use this card right here i should keep this out i don't know why i left it okay so let me get these cards out because they're like stuck in this box honestly i'm trying to get my my uk accent back i used to have a good one but I don't have none. Let me see any more. Okay. I know those are extra card here. I'm just trying to get them out of here. Okay. So your girl has it. All right. Thank you, angels. All right. So let's get your energy with this deck here. I feel like I needed to use this deck for gemini please what's going on in this situation for gemini what's going on in this situation for gemini angels what's going on what gemini wants to let us know okay your person told us a lot of what's going on but i feel like when I do this to get the full story because you know you have two sides of the truth and then the truth you know so let's see what's going on here Gemini please what does Gemini want us to know with this connection please all right so we have the knight of cups in reverse so you're seeing this person you know like they appear that they they act like they appear like they want a second chance but they don't give you a true apology they don't give you a true like this is important to me and i feel like gemini you're saying even if they give this to you you wouldn't take it because you just don't know where the future brings with this person you're just not secure with this person anymore in your heart so let's see here hmm i'm seeing you moving on with yourself here doing things on your own you're not happy about this you, you know loneliness you 
it's like you're thinking about being alone you don't want to be alone you want to be in a relationship but this relationship brought you nothing but unhappiness here the sun in reverse here this immature energy that you're dealing with a lot of jealousy that this person may have i'm also feeling like this person i'm getting like this person wants to just go back to the way things used to be before everything happened if that makes sense they want to go back into the beginning and give you another you know give you another chance here they want to work on their marriage um but i also feel like this is something important to you your family the ace of pentacles okay where you're thinking like damn you just want to be free honestly you don't want to have this feeling that you're feeling right now with this unhappy sun here but i feel like for some of you you're like you know what the most thing the most important thing is is me right now and focusing on myself my goals and my achievements even though this is something that i thought i was going to do with someone else i'm definitely going to do it myself you might have a negative energy moving forward with it where it's like just being lonely you just don't want to be lonely but you know what your main priority is having that legacy having something to leave your children having something to leave and say i did this put a dent in it you know so i'm seeing you working towards your money or your achievements here and i'm seeing you're doing really well actually so then we have the three of wands here like you feel like that boat from the past has sailed the seven of pentacles like you're not going to invest in it anymore oh my goodness but here comes this this lingering feeling <laughs> you're saying that this person apologized to you like if this person haven't is haven't yet they are because i'm seeing an apology um about someone that really value you and wanted you to be their one but they kind of felt they kind of fed you um the nine of wands in reverse which is empty promises all those cups in reverse like all the water is being poured out of those cups like none of those cups were filled with any kind of success any kind of goals like every one of those cups that they gave you were empty cups this is what i'm hearing like they talk 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 tell you what they're gonna do all the dreams that they have for you and them and nothing ever happened nothing ever happened I'm also seeing the Queen of Cups here. Somebody's holding back a lot of feelings. And I feel like you're saying you had to hold back a lot of your feelings towards this person because you do care about them. And here we have the Ten of Cups in reverse. Look at this. You see what I'm saying? It's just, this is just crazy. The Nine of Cups and the Ten of Cups follows. Ugh, oh, the Ace of Pentacles. It's like... This legacy is important, but this family is not. This this with with you and this person, you don't look at them as a long term or in the future, if that makes sense. Not anymore. You're willing to forgive them in the page of cups. So that's good. Ooh, okay. there is some like but you feel like you need the answers from this person like you feel like this is incomplete like the way you guys ended things is just not right it doesn't feel right i feel like your intuition is kicking in where you just don't know what to do i feel like you're trying to find out everything about what's going on with this person um there's a decision that needs to be made here on your end that you're ready to make okay what follows please the five of cups you feel abandoned in this relationship you feel abandoned in this relationship like this person just like you feel like okay like you're missing this person i'm seeing somebody missing this person like you're missing them okay hold on one second are you thinking about them yeah you want to make this work oh all right 
Gemini, this is surprising. That's why your readings are very, you could never know what a Gemini is thinking. Because once you think they're doing this, they're like, surprise. <laughs> yeah, because I should have knew because the Ace of Pentacles is your biggest um, thing. Like, this is what, this is it. You know, you, this is what's important to you. Your family, your legacy, whatever this is, your kids, you know, your home. You're going through so much right now with this person. It's kind of like you're like you're seeing a three of wands though that you sell. Like you're not gonna invest in this. But then I see some kind of letting go apology and forgiving this person here. This person that didn't fulfill your cup, but yet they make you feel like you're important to them, but at the same time they didn't do anything in the physical world um to seal the deal okay or make you feel this way instead they're bringing a lot of devastation into your life where you're feeling like okay we might not be together forever you know but my family is important to me so i will have to work everything out for my family i'm seeing you're trying to work things out with this person because you're missing those empty cups no shades but this is what the picture <laughs> these empty cups here i mean is this empty i mean they're about to be they're spilling all over the place you're on the floor like thinking about you know like you don't have any choices but you do like for some of you you're like oh it's too late for me i might as well just try to make this work i've been in this relationship with this person for such a long time don't think like that then we have um the temperance here the two of wands in reverse the eight of wow the eight of swords we have the knight of wands and we have the queen of pentacles in the back of the deck so i'm seeing a lot of healing that you're doing right now anyways um i feel like you know you made a lot of wrong moves here with this relationship and this is what you're trying to take responsibility of i'm seeing that you know you did walk away from this and did decide to take this like mental high road like to leave this relationship or to get have a break from this relationship for your mental state um this person though has no confidence no confidence in themselves so i'm not sure how this is going to work they have no confidence in themselves and they're draining every energy from you because all their confidence comes from you i don't know if you know that but this person yeah that's that's what it is all right, so give me five cards, please. Close this one up. Five cards. Yeah, they're coming back. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I kind of figured. The Ten of Wands here. Yeah, you know, you're at a point in your life where you just want to just pack your bags and go, but something is keeping you tied to this person. I'm seeing this person manifesting you, meditating, you know, asking the universe for help. Um, and I'm getting like, you know, of course you guys are tied together. So there is this feeling for this person as well. But they're really, really just like really thinking about you. And it's like sickening for me to tell you this a lot, but it's what it is, you know. And their fear is that you will leave them. You'll walk away from them. You will never return because of what they put you through with the anxiety um i'm seeing like you're tired of this person though you're it's like not the same e either way you go i'm seeing like you're not doing this for the love you're doing this for your family your legacy for some of you if you don't have kids it's your business okay all right so this person is waiting for you to make the move here but yet they know there's a conflict that needs to be addressed here but here, you, their, their worst fear is that you leave in the situation and never looking back. All right. So since we got your story here, um, and that's what you want to do. You just want to walk away from this person and never look back. But it's easier said than done. This is what I'm hearing with your energy, okay? Easier said than done. You have responsibilities, um, whatever that may be for you all right and believes okay for some of you that you're tied to because i'm feeling like if it's not financial 
it's definitely something that you just don't want to be judged by maybe separation or you know divorce for some of you is not an option no separation so all right but it's some kind of holding back like really just like holding back from leaving this person so let's see your future with this person please for gemini future Ooh. with this person the knight of pentacles the tower um yeah the tower in reverse oh interesting reverse and the chariot is still stuck in nowhere land. Hmm. Well, this person wants, I feel like this person is just thinking. They're just thinking. They're not doing nothing much, honestly, in the future. I feel like this person is not making any moves towards your legacy. That's important to you. All right. And they want to undo this conflict with you. Okay. Because we did see the strand where this person is going to talk to you. And it's going to build up the confidence. So I'm getting out of nowhere. You're probably at, you know, a party or at home. And here's somebody at your door trying to talk to you out of no, the blues when you're all moved on. Okay. This is what I'm hearing. Okay. So because they use their, they like appear. It's like they wear a mask. This is what I'm hearing. They wear a mask. And they could be the emperor. They could be the king of pentacles. Oh, the queen of pentacles very successful person and the truth is they're pages okay <laughs> pages <laughs> in reality oh my god that's devastating <laughs> that's devastating but this person still ain't making no moves towards you they their baggage is so deep they feel tied down yeah you blocked them that's why I'm seeing blockage in the future. Oh, but you're going to make peace with this. So hold on. Let me see. Because Gemini reading. Once I start reading, y'all, I'm thinking, oh, Gemini, you good. You good. And then you just surprise me. No, I'm going back to my boo. <laughs> I'm going back to my boo. Okay. The Hermit. Wheel of Fortune. You gonna, you gonna be fine, Gemini. Oh my God, look at you. You gonna be fine, honey. You got the wheel of fortune on your side. I see you moving towards success, doing your thing. You trying to find out what's good for you. You gonna be well taken care of with the universe. Mm -mm -mm. I see six of pentacles. You gonna have balance. The scales are coming back. So a lot of people from your past that disappointed you, I'm seeing like they're coming back to like even the scales this could include the person that you have blocked here all right i'm definitely seeing someone that you argued with someone that you didn't see eye to eye with someone that caused you a lot of pain this could be also family indicated as well people that's just like you didn't have a good tie to and they disappointed you in this life i see balance coming back to that okay i'm seeing healing six like i'm seeing healing for you but I'm also seeing a lot of stuff that you've been gone through, okay? Devastation, embarrassment from a lot of people um, that need to be let go here, all right? Let's keep going. Let's keep going. We have the devil in reverse. Yeah, this person is stuck. Something... <sighs> Uh, yeah, this person is stuck in something. They can't get to you. I'm thinking like somebody else. They're stuck with somebody else with this devil. It's either they're on drugs, drinking, or sexual addiction or something. Because they are stuck to the point that they can't make no movements towards you. Even in the devil right here. They're constantly thinking about you. But <laughs> to a pentacles right next to it. I knew I wasn't tripping. So there is somebody else that this person has, you know, they overwhelmed with this two of pentacles. So it's something that they have done. Oh, I'm getting, I'm hearing blackmailed. This person has got to be blackmailed. Okay. So we have the magician. And, oh, okay. Yeah. So this person, for some of y'all need to be careful. This person is reckless. I'm seeing like, ah. Uh, how do we start this? This is a horrible energy from the beginning of this reading. This person was throwing me off, y'all. 
this is a very horrible energy gemini that this person got going on Ugh, i really can't stand this person i can't stand their energy <laughs> sorry gemini but it's hard for me i'm getting like manipulation here recklessness this person got the nerve to talk crap to you i'm also getting stds here yo this person got too much going on and then they with they with somebody that they really really just have an unprotected sex with and then trying to come back to you at the same time i feel like you know this is out of control for them so of course they're coming they're trying to make a decision now but with this devil here they really stuck it's like they overwhelmed, can't make a decision, can't make a decision the way they want to. And it's like they want you to help them. They want you to do this, but they're free, they're like they're not making any movements or any <sighs> they're not making any movements to to change something. This person could be already in a toxic marriage if it's if they're not married to you, but I feel like they are. But there is something going on with this person that you have no like you don't know the facts about because at this I'm, I'm getting like you know things but because you don't trust them okay the fools is in reverse here but this person is constantly asking for another try remember when we had that other swatch this person's gonna ask you for um they want another chance but they were like too scared to to give it to you or to ask you for it because they don't know if it's gonna if it's gonna last right well here they are honey here they are they're coming okay they're coming get ready because this person is this energy is just a toxic energy i'm seeing like they're trying to be physical controlling too like mentally playing with your mind physically um abusive for some of y'all it doesn't have to be by their hand i mean yeah i mean yeah okay take that back Cause I'm like getting like physically at control live. It's like they're talking about your physical, like putting you down your, that's mental, but it's still talking about your physical body. Like they're putting you down here making you think that you're not something like something is wrong. Maybe they want you to get some work done or something, or they're just talking about your body, not being built enough, not being, you know, muscular enough or something making you feel like making you feel like you your your energy is low making you want your, your energy to be low here i'm getting all kinds of negative stuff y'all with this person uh, and then the strength card is in reverse in the future and that, it, it should you know because this person is not a good person okay well let's do five more cards please for Gemini, this person, please. Five more cards for Gemini. Close this up. Mm. Why the high for on? See, this is what messes me up here. The high for on is an upright. So, you know, this person doesn't want, they're moving. Okay, let me see what follows. Three of cups in reverse Ooh, okay ah oh, lord and the sun <laughs> look at that look okay let me just explain something y'all gemini because this person is giving me the creeps it's like he, this person is married to you all right or tied to you somehow but the way that this person thinks is just just nasty like they're moving towards something right making a decision to make things work or to um you know in a positive light but i'm seeing them moving towards or making a decision about this three of cups here right i'm finally telling you about it maybe putting an end to it okay because they want to be happy but at the same time with that you have the three of wands which is for me there is a decision that needs to be made between three people that this person is not making it's not making it's like they have three opportunities and they don't know which one is pick i i if this person can't know if this person doesn't know that you are their twin flame not twin flame soulmate excuse me soulmate connection then this person don't deserve you. 
period. If they cannot see that you are their soulmate connection, and the reason why they can't get you out of their minds and can't stop thinking about you is because is that um, tie, that 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 special soulmate connection. Like they feel fulfilled when they're with you, but yet they have their mind elsewhere. But Gemini. You don't have nothing to worry about. Once you get rid of this person, I see abundance here for you anyways. But once you get rid of them with their negative asses, you're going to have even more. This person is holding your, holding you back from abundance. I mean, and I feel like we talked about that in the beginning of this reading where you had abundance. You had things coming to you like the angels wanted you to wait. Oh, because this person... And then we have, see, they have the Ace of Pentacles. We have the Ten of Pentacles. Look, what, it's freaky. Like, I don't know what you're going to do because this person. Here we have the Six of Wands in reverse. This is how you're thinking of this person. They're, they're just, you know about, you, you already know that they're, they're fake, okay? They appear to be something that they're not, okay? And then you have the Queen of Pentacles, your energy, which you're just like focused on yourself, okay? But then you have this Ten of Pentacles here, and the Ace of Pentacles that follows. You have the Hyphorant here. This is telling me that you guys are going to try to be with this person. That's what, I mean, what's important to you is the abundance you guys build together. Okay, You're, either one is not going to try to give that up. The abundance, the family, some of you got kids together, house together, cars together, money lined up together. Ten of Pentacles, Ace of Pentacles follows the soulmate card. Whoever this, uh, I don't know. I just feel like there's a third party situation where this person knows about it, you know about it, you don't care about it. Your family is what matters here. Everybody has their own cup of tea, but this ain't mine. But <laughs> Gemini, I mean, you know, this like freaked me out, y'all, honestly. But everybody has their own thing, you know, their own thing. I understand that. I'm not here to judge nobody, okay? But here we have the Ace of, Pen Ace of Cups in reverse here. Like, you guys have a lot of love from each other, but you're not showing it, period, point blank. Look at that. It's all about the money. <laughs> you know what I'm getting? Like, that energy that is, um, it's like somebody knows what it means to be poor. And when you guys got together, this is like, you know, this is a, this is a collective, so I'm just telling you what I'm feeling okay and they don't want to go back to being starting from scratch so stay into this relationship and have the like the, the luxury because both basically there's a lot of luxury here have the luxury you know and be happy with that um it doesn't have to be love love is not what makes you happy you know those people that loves their children their family the th their surroundings is what keep them happy is not potentially the love so you know that's what i'm hearing i don't know this this is the weirdest reading i ever had in my history of being a reader okay so can i have some messages for gemini please can I have some messages for Gemini? Thank you, angels. Appreciate it. Okay, so we have, when I found out you're already married, it broke my heart. Eee! Ah, I brought that up too. I said, this person look like in the devil, like they're married in a relationship, but 
damn i sh i also feel like this person is could be married to you as well because but at the same time with this card this person is probably staying with because i'm saying it's not the love it's about the money and this person is not leaving this situation i'm like and the devil is like is either you take me or leave me this way but i'm not i i care about you i'm attracted towards you i have this addiction towards you but i am not leaving my situation it's like i've been in the situation for a long time this is it tell me more for gemini i knew something was off about you so i'm getting a fire sign aries leo or Sag, earth sign capricorn virgo or taurus Water sign, Scorpio, Cancer, Pisces. We really need to talk. So somebody really wants to talk, wants some clarity in the situation. Tell me more. Let's see him talking. Continue to have faith. Because someone is losing it. Stop calling me. It's over. You're a stalker. <laughs> the devil. I see new beginnings continue to have faith. The angels want you to continue to have faith. They see new beginnings, you know? This is what I have for you, Gemini. I mean, I love you guys. Please stay positive. I know you guys are going through it. Um, and I'll see you guys in your next one. Bye, guys.